So look at the way that all the lithograph and the thermoses and stuff are all displayed. It's so great. Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. Today I am in New Albany, Indiana at Antiques Attic. It's a sweet little, we've got some really cool buildings. There's an odd, oh look there's a Mark. Hi Mark. It's an odd fellows building. They have a really nice farmer's market. Nice little downtown area. Look at that old theater. The fair. The flower pot for $7. Now we are down right. Just go over the river and we'll be in Kentucky. So salt and pepper shakers here. This is a pretty picture here for spring. Um. Well, I can't read any of that. Hand painted. It's pretty though, isn't it? Seventeen fifty. So more silhouettes up there. Wow. Fifteen dollars each for those smaller ones. Oh, what are you doing, girl? Oh, your little maid is shining her mirror so you could fix your little hair. This is a really pretty console set here. Be great for Halloween. Made in Japan piece with the candlestick, 1750. This is pretty too, wow. Hand painted. Looks like it's German or Austrian possibly. Oh, all those Hardy Boy books. Oh, it's utility box, this is biography. It's wood burning. This is fifteen dollars. Looks like it has a. Oops. It's opening it up the wrong way. A little hinged box there. Just some ephemera down here, and this is a piece that I'm going to get the crimson. Uh, February 1943. So this is wartime, and it's two dollars and fifty cents. But I love the graphic that's on there. So let's pull some more of these out and see. It. That's some deer. It. That's the Gordon's Fisherman. That's what he looks like, at least. Oh, wow. The Crimson. Here's another one. I just love these wartime books, and I love those graphics. Oh, look at the Wee Wonder. Wee Wonder. This is a Singer Science series. Oh my gosh, it's got fun graphics in it. A dollar fifty, but oh my gosh, that color! Here's the crimson, Captain Don Ridge. I don't like the uh, graphics as much on that one. I'm trying to figure out. Here's another one. Oh, I love that. It's got the V for Victory, though. I like that. Since two fifty. I don't know what these are though. Can you like? Can you open that so we can see? This is it. 25 pieces dated 1938. Weekly pamphlet. Takes an issue, gives advice. Oh, okay. If you want true friends and real success, put this courage checklist daily and do use it. Do these things even though they seem hard at first. Oh, this is Mo Hills out of mountains. Do be courteous. Live on my pay to jump in and do my level best. Be enthusiastic to stick at it until it's done, to tell the truth, to be uncritical, to speak gently, to be tolerant, to be confident. I kind of like that. I don't understand. Like, there are all these little pamphlet things. Dated 1938. Hmm. Well, kind of. I'm going to get those couple things. And then here we have the money order, register of money order post offices of the United States. Oh, joy. Oh, it's James Whitcomb Riley. He's in Indiana. Lad. This is 250 I'm a sucker for these, though. Yeah, I'm going to get that, too. I need more books, like I need a hole in my head, but. And this is 
more streets and roads. This is another reader. It's 250, but I always look. Um, hmm. Happy days are here again. This is 550. I can't help it. I like the cover of that. Sugar Creek Group. Primer. Oh my god. Oh, gross. That's got a stinking clown on it. But it's got a kitty and an elephant. This one's also 550. The pupils, grade three. So it's got some. Don't like that one as well. Here, I sp no, this is Viking. This is a Viking stuff. That was Ellie Smith. This is a Viking six petal compote for ten. So I think I'm going to get that as a six petal. You can see those looks like flower petals in there. So I'm going to get that. I'm seeing some Ellie Smith. Those are green and an amberino one for nine fifty. This is the moon and star. Hmm. Real quick, I will show the Fiesta. I always get yelled at. Well, not yelled at. I get a talking to if I don't show the Fiesta. But you can see these are um, not bad prices. Four dollars each on the plates and stuff. It's just the pictures here are forty five. I love that yellow. But I wanted to show it. I'm not buying it today, but I wanted to at least show it. All right, so I did just grab me a little, um, a little Occupy Japan. So I'm looking for a couple of these little pieces. Here's a little piece here, a little Lefton Angel for a 750. And oh, here's a little Bloomer Girl. She's Lefton as well. Her bow and everything look really good. I'm, I have Mark with me, so Mark has better eyes than me sometimes when looking over these things. So I'm gonna have him look these two girls over. She's also left in the Christopher collection, but I've sold the Bloomer Girl before and I, I like the little February girl here. Um, this is a beautiful tile. It's hand painted for 450. So, this is an Aladdin lamp. This is the Lincoln drape can see how it looks like it has little curtains that are draped um, and it's not been electrified $95 $93 is a really good price for that it's not been electrified sometimes you'll see them and they've been electrified but this still has the oil um, components to it but it's in a very kind of a soft almost a pinky fleshy tone if you will but that's a great piece there too and then, I, I mean, I haven't even gotten... It, I've seen so many things that I can't wait to go and look at, but we're starting here. This is different, too. It almost has, like, a cameo opalescent to it. Footed dish. You could put a little cake on that. You could use it for a riser. I'm trying to, to decide what color I think that is. It's, like, a little bit of pink and a little ambery. I'm gonna think about that. I've got the ashtray, the black milk glass, the dog on it. But so far I'm seeing all kinds. Of, here's the base to it, Ellie Smith Fairy Lamp. It's missing the bottom. A little Schwann. Here's another Aladdin lamp. $25 is an amazing price on that. Wow, is that with the fiberglass shade? got this green base and it's a um, like a slag glass Let's look at the bottom that's beautiful I might think about that too I don't necessarily like to ship lamps but that one's looks like it's measurable or manageable that's the word this is viking here um a little rose bowl for 750. it's a great price i'm i'm being a little picky today because well all weekend actually we're on our way down to nashville tennessee so we only have so much room oh my wow 
these Aladdin lily lamps. $65 for the pair. That's an amazing price. Listen, if you are in the um, New Albany, Indiana, and you're looking for, I'm, for some Aladdin lamps, these are lovely. Wow. Look at this little, that little pot there for 12 It's pretty. Oh, you got my cherries, little baby. There's some fitting with the little cats you can see. See at the top? There's a little kitty cat up there coming out of that shoe. $9.50. I'm going to open up. I see some ladies in here. Oh, she's pretty in her little... Oh, be careful, Misty. Don't break the glass on the cabinet. She's got her little pearls and her teal necklace. She's 85 which is a very fair price for her. She's so pretty and fancy. This one, she reminds me of Betty Davis with her eyes closed. I know Betty Davis is known for her big bright eyes, but um, she's Ralph Poe. That's a Ralph Poe mark on the bottom there. I don't know why she reminds me of Betty Davis, but she does. I said, look at this big bird cage. It's $55. It's pink and teal. That's amazing. Here's another little book that I'm going to get. It's a dollar. It's Life in the Sea. It's got the seahorse on it. It's a little wonder book, so I'm going to get that. Oh my gosh, I wanted to show you guys this amazing shelf. It's $147. It's Victorian. Look at the little cherubs on it. These are brass um, panels that are on each side. Oh my gosh. That is amazing. I absolutely love that. She has an amazing display here. There's several of these um, Bohemian cut to clear. There's a blue egg and a green egg. They're $20 each. This is a great, great price. And then some Fostoria. The Jamestown with the original sticker on it. $27.50 for seven of them. That's amazing. I see some Fenton. This little Fenton hobnail for 10. I'm gonna get that. It's been doing pretty well with the opalescent on the top there. Here we've got a little Daisy and Buttons red basket for 10. Would which would be great for Christmas, Valentine's Day, but you know what? It would also be great for Val um, for Saint, not St. Patrick's Day, goodness gracious, for 4th of July. Here's a little covered Daisy and Button compote made by Fitton, $22.50. That, got some of these little um, sea balls. It's <laughs> not the right word, I know it's not the right term, but I like this too. Um, the tumbler. Mark has the um, black light. Rather black light. I just wanted to see if some of these this tumbler glows. I love the optic in it. No. This is a neat shoe. It is Redware. And it's from Florida's Silver Springs. It's a clay. It's like a Victorian boot with this um Maybe blue bridge pottery. I'm going to say that wrong too. I'm saying a lot of things wrong today. Oh, I love bells. I have a whole little collection of bells, little service bells. Oh, I'm going to get this mark. Oh, I was going to check on that one, seven. So I'm also going to get that one as well. I love that blue collar. And then I love these. 22. There was a pink one up, up here too. And then some more Bohemian glass. This one's really nice. Um, it's um, it's got the red or the white on it for 22.50. Cut to cranberry. That's beautiful. It's amazing that artists artists the artwork that went into making ashtrays all right we got lots to see look at him he's got some side eye are you a decanter 
Oh, you're a lighter. Richmond, Virginia. Craven's lighter, as is. Let's see. Where's your as is? Oh, your ear. I'm really liking his side eye, though. And you can see here, small little square flower frog for $5. I do not have one of this shape, so I'm going to get that for me. Look at these little characters. I like the little parrot, though. The $12.50. We've got some Wade Whimsies. Oh, there's a squirrel. They're $3 each. A zebra. Ugh, clown. There's some California pottery up there. Oh, penguin made by Lennox. All right, so we've got a couple little things here. Oh, well, look at her. She's got her little hands on her hips. She's a little bell. A little tulip bell. For six. I like her little attitude. I don't normally buy bells, but I'm going to get you. Because I think that you're fun for spring. And I like that you are sassy. You're a sassy girl. Oh my goodness, your heads. Oh my, those are so cute. They're little noddles. They need restrung. $75 for the pair. Oh my gosh, these little nodders here. They're $12.50 each. There's some more there for $20. Oh, there's a clown back there. We don't care about him. Some tin types. These little service girls are cute. Oh, they're also little bells. I want to show you guys these this, these tramp art boxes. $75 each. These are amazing and highly collectible. Um, then they're exactly what they, what, they're just a handcrafted tramp art piece that someone has crafted and homemade. This one is lovely too. Turn them into jewelry boxes. Oh, this one has a mirror on it. So those are really neat. And look at these picture frames. Look. Well, we're going to look at butterflies today. Oh, and tomorrow we'll look at something. I mean, so you could actually put different pictures and change your mind, but I think that's great. It's a homemade inlay wood double frame. It's very unusual. This little baby's like, I'm looking at that duck right there. There he is. He's a, oh, look at his little butt. He's 850. He's adorable. All right, we've got some more Fenton. Boy, Jay, you would be losing your mind in this place, my friend Jay. So we've got some yellow glass candlesticks. I'm going to have Mark bring over the light to see if this custard glass glows. I'm going to go out on a limb and say, yeah, it do. Oh, look at the bunny. Oh, you're cute for $7.50. Even if you don't glow, I'm going to get you. We're going to put you, we'll put you right here. And then we've got, isn't this lovely? The Fenton Stars and Stripes Cranberry Glass. It's $30. That's fun. Oh, wow. We've got some Mary Gregory and some Rose Bowls and some more um, Cranberry Opalescent. I'm going to leave that open so I don't forget to have Mark come and test some of those pieces. I love you. I love you too, little girl. For seven fifty, we gonna get you. And um, the lady that owns it, we're like, can we make some piles? And she was like, oh yes, I love piles. Now, now we're getting into an area that I'm gonna probably lose my mind over a little bit. But oh my gosh, look at the little thing. So we got the little huggies, the little huggy bear shakers. They're very cute. I kind of just tend to find like the, these are, I think these are bunnies. So honestly, I might get those. I might get the bunnies because we're getting, we're approaching Valentine's Day. They are six fifty. So I think I'm going to get those. Down here I see some pigs, but oh my gosh, look at him. Look at him for his mink. Or maybe he's saving for her mink. But he's 22. He is made by Royal Copley. Look at his little hooves and his little bum bum in the back. Mm, my gosh, he's adorable. All right, here we've got, this one's unusual too. It's $6.50 for the salt and pepper. It's a pipe on a pipe stand. I like the little penny doll. It's a little cowboy 
for a dollar, I'll get you a little side eye. Some little pudas for $7.50. Oh gosh, I like those marlins for $7.50. I probably will definitely will be getting those. Alright, I'm gonna put the little penny doll up. Goodness, look at all of the little dogs and poodles. A little poodle here for $9.50. I think I've actually had that one before, but I'm gonna get her. Got a little Japan poodle there. A little Springer Spaniel little disc. So I'm gonna get that poodle up there. What are you? What are you? What do you got on your back, little doggy? Are you? What are you? A flashlight? I don't understand. I'll have Mark look at that and see if he can help me figure that out. Chalk dog. The friendly bank. Hey Mark, what's up with this little dog here? Do you think you could figure that out? What's going on with him? What's his deal? Oh, look at this little Royal Copley Cocker Spaniel wall, wall pocket planter. I'm going to get that as well. Any idea? No. Nope. <laughs> He's a mystery. Oh, and look at all the advertising. Oh, Jean Nate. Oh my gosh. All right, look, uh, we're going to take a... We don't know what that is. Mark says it, he, it had like a, a bulb of some sort in it. Here is a chalk tin for $4. I'm going to get that. I'm a sucker for those. Bullion cubes. I typically... I like the kitchen things too, but I typically look for bathroom items for myself. I like to have odd bathroom items items um corn silk oh i like that jewel tea cocoa all remember jewel tea oh yeah it's 22.50 i think a lot of people like their jewel tea items um nescafe for 17.50 that is an amazing pink touche so this is an amazing section over here with Halloween and Christmas, but I want to show you something I've never seen before, and it's this ceramic tree, but it hangs on the wall. Isn't that so cool? It's $145. It has the wire down there, but it hangs on the wall. So this one right here is $75, and that one's $75 as well, which is not a bad price for those at all. Wow. There's all kinds of fun. Look at the lights down here. $95 for those. But it's a whole fun little section over here. Look at the old look at the look at the old hills. This is $750 for the Yuletide electric centerpiece. Let's see. That's pretty fancy. I like the box. It's a pretty cool box. Look at the hills though, Mark. You see that? <laughs> And then we have some Noma for $17.50 in the original box. Great price. Great, great price on those. And then I see some of these I need to look at because I collect these and that's these weird mod angels. I oh I like the one with the blue bird. Oh he's got a little pink bird. So this one's 10. I don't like him asthma. Oh, you want to hold him? Thank you. But she's fun. The problem is, is I have a lot of these tall ones, and then they I have a hard time putting them somewhere. So I need like these little shorter girls. They're $10. I don't think I'm gonna get them right now. I'm not feeling the Christmas mood, but look at these little goobers. Wow. $20, that is a great price. They're still in their original packaging and look at his, he's in his little teal. They kind of look like little hillbilly pixies. Oh, put that back on. Adora light. Oh my gosh, this is just fun, fun, fun stuff to see. Gosh, look at this. That's fun. I would like to, ha I would use this as a display. What are you doing, girl? Or boy? Smoking a cigarette? Fixing shoes? I think that's what that, that's all about. Oh my gosh, look at all of the toys. Eek. This is just so amazing. Oh, yeah, look at the... 
the little Halloween paper mache guys. So look at the way that all the lithograph and the thermoses and stuff are all displayed. It's so great. The three little pigs. I'm gonna try to keep talking so we can talk over the radio a little bit, but you can see, look at the TV lamps up here. Those are all pretty amazing. And all of the soft sided lunch boxes. The pussy cats. $145 for the pussy cats. Donnie and Osmond, Annie, Bebbles and Pam Pam, Tinker Bell. And then I don't know if <laughs> Pat D's, look, you're in, you'd be in heaven today. Look right here. It's all cleanser, cleaner Kate. I have her. This one is, she's $12.50. She, yeah, I, I love cleanser Kate. she got a little boo boo. She's got a little boober on her nose, but. We like Cleanser Kate. That's a blendo. I wanted to show you too all the Pyrex in here, which I don't really buy because I don't really like to ship it. I know it's very popular and all that jazz, but I don't like to ship it. These are pretty for $18.50. And oh, the tile art. That's neat. $35 for the pair. I'm telling you what. Come here, guys, and shop. The prices are wonderful wonderful you have to come you have to come here um oh my gosh look at these oh man these are all harmony house 35 dollars for the set 21 pieces i'm tempted i'm not going to because of space but I am tempted. I'm tempted by a lot of things, but I have to, I can't, I can't, I, I have to save space. Can't get it all. We've got some enamel in here, but wow. It's just amazing. It's amazing. Well guys, this was a great, great place. I'm looking forward to this shop is, I come down to this area often never been in here before but this is definitely a place i'm going to come back and check more often so if you are in the new albany area make sure that you come into uh, this place and it's just i'll give you another little space walk in and it's just just filled with treasures so make sure that you come on in she said they add things every single week and Come on in and support this small antique store and buy some fun treasures. And as always, guys, please, please leave a comment on this video. Everything that you saw me pull are things that I purchased. So if you see anything that you might be interested in, you can send me an email, thriftorjunkervintagehunter at gmail.com. And as always, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Bye, guys. Red hot mama, red hot mama, you're the one we need. Red hot mama. Some drama, yes indeed you say that I should be In the follies, hot tamales you say that I got a pair of eyes Just like old Svengali's I confess that I possess